是不会这么样的，欢迎简历，挑战篮球的标准是。Okay, just coming in under the uh, just under the barrier here just before 6 p.m. Well done. Yes. Uh, 
congratulations. All right. Another finisher here. As we're waiting for Jeff Montevallo from the United States, who's going to be our third big finisher. In the inaugural 180 points race. In number two, uh, Will it fall? Another runner coming in strong. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Fast and furious to the finish line. So, uh, I'm reliably informed Jeff Montevallo, the United States, our third place finisher in the 180k. With the way out to my he is within one kilometre of the finish line. As the last of our runners are starting to come in now for the 50k race that started here this morning at 6am. Okay, there we go, charging to the finish line. Yeah, well done. So yeah, Jeff, he's going to complete the podium, the top three podium for the 180 degrees. Those top three runners will qualify for a musical round. World Series final in Chelsea France in August 2023. So they get to run even more of these races. So uh, congratulations to all those guys. A huge congratulations to everyone here at West Bayonne. You're doing such a great job to cheer all of our crowd. So the energy works both ways. So the more you give, the more they run. So it's, uh, it's a great job that everyone's doing here. We've got a lot more runners to cheer in this evening. The 100k runners, the 180k runners. Yeah. 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 So yeah, our first runner in the uh, 100k should be in at 7 o'clock, Yin Yang Kao from China currently now in front of being chased down by two uh, American athletes. Our next two female athletes coming in here to the finish line. So many, so encouraging to see so many female athletes here at Weather by Outer by UTIB. Well done, Amigas. Yeah, <laughs> well done. Congratulations. You are finishers. <laughs> So the 50k runners, they've been running now for 12 hours. 12 hours in this crazy heat, this crazy humidity. Up and down the mountains, through the jungles. And our, our next finisher now, definitely not giving up. He's probably had better days, but he is going to make it to the finish line. And you know why? Because you are all going to cheer this guy to the very, very end of this race. He's almost here. The man in orange. Come on, Pesel Ayata. Let's give this guy the biggest cheer. Woo! Applause, applause. Oh, he's, he's going to do it. He's definitely going to do it. Yes, yes, yes! Oh, oh, oh. Never, ever give up! Oh, 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 oh. Well done. Good stage and fantastic after that. That's what Travel is all about. It's never, ever give up. Oh. After 24 hours of racing, our top three men within 50 minutes of each other. So congratulations to Jeff, to Josh, and to Dave Stevens, your top three finishers. Our next runner's coming in now. Well done, guys. Well done, girls. Fantastic effort.
Tokyo Race Experience. So, uh, for those runners who are maybe not here, who are like, and also the trail was a trail that most runners have never been on before. How, how, it, looking at the times, it looked brutal. Awesome, awesome. And what was, apart from the heat and humidity and not in the dark, what else was tough about it? So, looking at your race results, is this your, is this your best race result, Dave? So the good thing to say is placer, thank you. Increíble poder estar. Tenemos cámaras sociales, cámaras acá, cámaras por todos lados. Estamos con el sol. Y ahí se va a estar de la situación de la situación total. Pero por más de que se está en el periodo y al final creo que es parte de la situación. A ver, nos vamos, vamos a fijar la, la diferencia de aquí en Bromas. Te quiero hacer una pregunta más, quizás, te eh, la han hecho en algún momento, pero ¿por qué? ¿Por qué la semilla? ¿Por qué está acá? ¿Por qué ponerse la zapatilla? ¿Por qué este deporte? ¿Por qué lo elegís? ¿Por qué entrenás? Porque eh, está, digamos, eh, que la montaña, que es lo que la primera vez que hay una zapatilla, que es lo que está, Martín es un puerto, pero aquí es un puerto de estudio, y eso es lo más que quiero hacer. ¿A qué le dedicas? Y sacar de otro lado, imagino familia, amigos, a mucho entrenamiento, hay mucha historia detrás de un corredor de vida, así que lo que quieras decir, están los medios presentes, libre el micrófono para mis saludos a quien quieras. No, la verdad es que quiero agarrar el micrófono, estoy muy contento de la carrera, de este equipo, también después a mi equipo de apoyo, a Fernando Martínez y a Luis, que van a estar en noche dándole, dándole en cada punto que necesite de mí y eso que se mantiene. Nos vemos en Francia, nos vemos allá, vas a viajar, vas a estar directo a Saborí, me imagino. Sí, 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 claro, eso tenemos que tener lo que tengo que mostrar aquí. Llegar entre los tres, ¿sí? ya, 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 ya se lo veo, solo que digamos que eso porque no se ha es el único ganar, pero lo vamos a tener contentos porque ganamos a ganar. Bienvenidos, felicitaciones, somos de la que se vende en las tres primeros que viajan directo sin escala a Francia, al Saborí. Vamos a dar un aplauso, no, dale, le damos un aplauso para los tres que ya están con nosotros. Increíble momento, Kike. Wow, qué lindo, qué bueno. Ok, uh, Jeff, come on, Jeff, come on down to us, my friend. So we've got the top three for the 180 kilometers. So Jeff, get out of the mountain, running around the mountains, the jungle, through the night for 24 hours, 180k. So, uh, so Jeff, tell us about your race experience. Yeah, we, um, we were, uh, I mean, the original timings, we were laughing about how they were obviously thinking about the trail that most people have been running before. It's obviously the timings around for that particular reason. So, how tough? Was that true? It was extremely hard. Um, talking to Chris from Hope before the race, his biggest concern was would you drink enough on the course just to stay hydrated? Pretty, pretty much the same as everyone else. So, how difficult was it to drink enough in those conditions? Yeah, I got super nauseous around my 45 to my 60. I was like, I threw up a bunch. I felt fantastic. And then when the heat came, I went for a heat trip and I had to go over the summer. I actually moved a lot and I just rolled around and everything came out. So, so cool. We were all very fortunate last night to be able to send some nasty to the West Indies, kind of really interesting, kind of indigenous kind of region of Jalisco. We're curious, your experience in the villages around in the mountains, how was that? So, I would never come here. And from your point of view, did you have a particular, what was the, what was the high point for you during the race? Me and Dave were together. And uh, I hear that the roof of was like pretty, like scrambling, savage. It was very scary. Yes. And then, um, how, how rubble were the, uh, how rubble were the camp walls? They sounded like they were also like rocky as, as anything, right? They were very hot. <laughs> so now as you, so the good news is, as a top three finisher here, that means you qualify for this year's UTV, shall you? So, uh, you happy about that? Okay, so any other final thoughts, uh, kind of any, kind of like, like, I don't know, right hot moments that you had during the race just out there on the course, anything you want to share with all of us? Also, uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is our third place finisher in this year's uh, Puerto Vallarta by UTMB 180 promises, Jeff Oliveira Team Hopper. So thank you, Jeff, and now you can go and enjoy the hospitality of Puerto Vallarta and Jalisco. Thank you. Okay, Puerto Vallarta, the party continues. We have more and more of our lovely runners coming into the finish area here. Well done, 50k in the bag. Mission accomplished. 
to Alan Beach right now. We have all of the, uh, the kids out to races. We're also waiting for the first runners in the 100k mentality this morning from uh, Maskota. So we're expecting Yun Yang Kiao from China. He should be our first winner in about 7 o'clock. We're also waiting for our first female athletes in the 180k. So they're going to be at about 8.30. So we're going to be cheering a lot of runners this evening all the way through to tomorrow morning about 3 or 4 a.m. Saludando al cielo, perdón, sorry, aquí, pero con toda la energía de Dios mío. Great to see you. Ah, 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 ah,
muchísimo más. 24 horas, nació millas. Gracias. 